Tonight, George Santos's second act. Out front is learning that the disgraced former congressman is receiving hundreds and hundreds of requests to record personalized videos on the website Cameo. His fee has now jumped to $350, up from $250 just this morning. And Santos is loving it as he's recording his latest videos, including one of him singing his favorite Taylor Swift song for a customer. My favorite Tia song is definitely going to be Trouble. I knew you were trouble when you walked in. That's me. Bye. Sunland Sarfati is out front. Well, happy, happy birthday. Or I can just do the happy birthday to you. Former Congressman George Santos basking in the glow of the spotlight. Merry Christmas. Have a fantastic new year. Mwah. Love you all. Wearing his new status like a badge of honor. I, mean, I was a whole congressman up until last Friday. As he amplifies and cashes in on his expulsion from Congress. Hey, look, it is what it is. I'm no longer a congressman. Maybe Santos becoming an overnight show, star on Cameo, leading to a private lunch with the CEO of the celebrity video message platform today in New York. Demand for a personalized video from Santos so great, his latest fee was $350, nearly four times what it originally was just two days ago. Let's talk about best dress, worst dress, right? Look up Glenn Grothman from the state of Wisconsin, and you'll understand what I'm saying when I'm talking about worst dressed in Congress. And even as he actively solicits more, a source with knowledge tells CNN that Santos is receiving hundreds and hundreds of requests a day, including from his former colleague, Senator John Fetterman, purchasing a video to troll Senator Bob Menendez, who is also under federal indictment. Hey, Bobby, uh, look, I don't think I need to tell you, but these people that want to make you get in trouble and want to kick you out and make you run away, you make him put up or shut up. Santos is quest to blaze his own post-Congress path, ripping a page out of Trump's own playbook. You have haters? Let them hate. Like, just do you, girl. Screw the haters. Brazen. The hell with this place? Defiant. I'm going to make a funny post about roasting Mr. I am former principal and I thought fire alarms opened doors, Jamal Bowman, which I think should be expelled from Congress next. And bitter, threatening to name names and take down some of his former congressional colleagues with him. Now, if the House wants to start different precedent and expel me, that is going to be the undoing of a lot of members of this body because this will haunt them in the future. Santos going after four House members since his departure from Congress, threatening to file ethics complaints against them. All this as Santos leans into the mockery. Everyone, stop assaulting me. I'm being assaulted. <laughs> this entire country has been bullying me just because I'm a proud gay thief. And Santos, now as a former congressman, is no longer subject to campaign finance laws. And a source tells me he's making a great deal of money off Cameo, and he's certainly, Aaron, trying to capitalize it. He was up until 2 a.m. last night taping video messages of himself, of course, trying to meet the big demand of all these requests. Aaron. Oh, right, and increasing uh, the prices. <laughs> it's actually amazing. Sometimes, you know, we do feel like we're living in some sort of a weird world. <laughs> all right, Sunlin, thank you very much. Sunlin Sarfati.